Ready? Hmm? How are you always eating and so skinny? I'm a fake girl. <laughs> <laughs> da, are you ready one last time? Yeah. Mm. I'm sad though. Me too. It was the only gig I had. No joke. <laughs> <laughs> Um, good evening. Good evening. Good morning. Whenever you're watching this, yeah, I I, I can't do this anymore. I'm 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 so emotional, yeah. baby. I can't. One last time. One last time. I'll make a song out of everything. I have nothing. <laughs> Hi everyone. And what are you doing? Fixing this, okay? Uh, you should fix the entire outfit. <laughs> I look gorgeous. She's wearing one piece of fabric <laughs> with two strings attached. <laughs> I was like, she came with this dress. It was literally a piece of fabric with two necklaces attached. She was like, this is my finale dress from the room view. It was like, I made it myself. That's a dress? Okay, I bought it myself. Anyways, I'm What's wearing glitter. I'm wearing glitter. Glitter fix everything, honey. Hi everyone and welcome to the final and last episode yeah. of the room view. Uh, we are here to review the last episode of Drag Race Holland. Look at my pearly tears. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is this has been so much fun so far. Yeah. Um, never thought that this little show would get so much support from all the fans. For all the people watching. Uh, we are here to review the yeah. final episode of Drag Race Holland. Yeah. And I think we should just get into this last episode. Let's get into Drag Race Holland. Yes. Are you ready? Let's go! Start your engines. <laughs> Karma, bitch. Karma. Now let's get into this final episode. Oh, by the way, I'm back! <laughs> the grand final! What would Envy do? That's the most important question. This, what, what would Envy do? This girl has been talking to me a week like, what would Envy do? <laughs> <laughs> Envy, if you're watching this. No. What would you do? <laughs> what would you do? <laughs> She's busy wearing a $18,000 dress from Clazy Person on the cover of Cosmopolitan. The girls enter the workroom and they are mad. They're like, Abby, you should have gone home. Why are you still here? It is what it is. We're not producer of this show. Uh, gladly, we're not. Miss Abby, oh my god, and Envy Peru are having a sister talk. There is no drama, but... It's television. Top three! Ah, that's you! Me. Really? You. you look so great. Thank you. Yeah, you look so great. That, that's my man. <laughs> Hi Chelsea boy, hi, hi. So, Megan, Patty and me are walking into the workroom after what feels like six years. <laughs> We're like, oh, this is what it looks like. When we got there, we didn't really know who was eliminated when. I only knew um, until Megan. Yeah. I was so excited to see who was still there. And then now the other girls are entering the room and I was like, what the hell is Chelsea Boy doing here? Why isn't she in the top four? Yeah, it was a little reunion. Cute. Also very confused to see Sister Jean. Maybe. Yeah. I was like... Hmm. And this conversation that you see between me and all the other eliminated girls literally lasts for like one, two hours. I don't know. And it was like not even five minutes on TV. I was like, oh, oh, okay. We were talking about all the challenges. We were talking about everything. The girls are like, who should it be in the top three? There is a top three. I see stuff from Envy, from Mama, from Janie, but not from Abby. And so she's like, mm, she only has like <laughs> two pairs of clothes. So like, yeah, <laughs> so funny, so funny. And Fred is entering the workroom now and he meets the girls again. Yeah, we all so, look so happy though. Yeah, it was yeah. so fun to see him again. Oh, Madness Beard is back. <laughs> Guys, so he's back in the house. 
Shell Shade is a bit better. Just a little bit. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> you'll be like, hmm, girl. Evil plan. <laughs> and Jade's like, hey. <laughs> Not these girls again. What you didn't see is that they also asked us who we thought should win. Oh my god, I want that dress so Me bad. Too. It looks so great on me. Look at my body. Oh, also looks great on Patty Panda. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> for this episode, the girls need to prepare a dance for a RuPaul Matley. Then also have to do a very emotional um, interview with Fred and Nikki Plessy. Nikki Plessy. And last best, the girls need to serve their ultimate best drag. Oh, no. So I'm very excited to see it. Me too. Yeah. The girls only, I feel like, had like two hours to rehearse this. No. Or three, something, but very limited time. Yeah. Usually episodes get filmed in two days. Yeah. But this was filmed in one day. So, pressure. Abby is not really doing well. No. She's a dancer. It's what she said. A re this 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 really pressure though. And it's not a simple dance as well. No. If there's one person who does not have any difficulty with dancing, it's Miss Jack Hay. Yeah. Nikki sees the girls out of Jack for the first time. Yeah. And she's like, oh we They're not women all the time. <laughs> you guys are so pretty. Yes they are. Mm -hmm. Mama Queen has a chance now to explain herself, to explain uh, what it's like to be non-binary, so... Very important. Yeah, I think it's really important. Especially to the judges. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. What Mama Queen also says is that she doesn't feel like she's different. She feels like other people are locked up yeah. in rules that are made by society and that she feels like she broke herself free. And I totally uh, agree with what she says. Yeah. And Janie is letting her wall down yeah. again. I think that's very good for Janie. Yeah, for I think it's very good. But the place in your walk. You know how great it feels. Like the girls and me were sitting backstage. We're getting ready and we hear this song and we're like, yes. What do you think about Fred's look? It's not my favorite though. No. Especially not for the finale. No. But I think it's cute. Yeah. Nikki. What's that dress you're wearing there? Looks very similar. Yeah, to something we don't talk about anymore in this oh, house. Oh, look who's back as well. <laughs> talking about not talking about people. <laughs> Clay's Everson is back. Not interested, interested in Nikki. Nikki tutorials, Nikki the Yahar. Oh. Everyone's like, oh, Ruby is so sad that she didn't get to see Nikki. Girl, I did get to see <laughs> Nikki. Fun story later in this episode about that. <laughs> She looks so yeah. damn good. She looks great. She looks beat. So we were getting ready backstage for uh, the runway and some of the producers came and they were like, um, do you want to see the girls perform? And we were like, of course. <laughs> so we were led to a little uh, backstage area. Yeah. They had some screens ready for us and all the girls were allowed to sit backstage. But they were like, listen, you can't say anything because we need the audio. But listen, you're sitting with a group of drag queens who are, I'm, I'm the biggest fan of all these queens, yeah. let alone the other girls. So we were not allowed to scream, clap, do anything, just sit with a half face of makeup backstage on the screen watching. And we were, I was gagged because this was so good to me. I was like, wow. But the other girls were like, yeah, wow, da, 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 da. And the producer were like, shh, 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 shh. Envy is serving Kylie Minogue realness. <laughs> Yeah. Mama Queen looks very science fiction alien-esque. Abby as well. Don't know what Janie is serving, but... Sure. She's, she's serving something, okay. <laughs> Nikki's like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I love that part. Ah. It was so great. I was like, yeah. ooh, yeah! My mouth was like, ugh. Yeah! So good. So proud of them. So good, right? Yeah. The girls uh, did this 
I think, four, five, maybe six times, yeah. this dance. Because we were allowed to watch it one or two times, I think. And then we got back to getting ready. But we heard the music again and again and again and again. And it was like, these poor girls. The worst thing after that was that there was uh, an issue with audio. <sighs> We had to wait <laughs> for four hours for them to fix the audio. So imagine this. I was ready in full drag to get on that runway. After a long day, waking up early, getting into full drag. Then had to wait for maybe five hours for them to fix the audio. God, I took everything off. <laughs> I was like, not today! I was on the couch, just like episode one, I was like... <laughs> but after these hours, uh, we were allowed to strut one last time on the runway. And uh, we're gonna watch that now. All the eliminated girls are yeah. back one last time on the runway. Here we go, the moment we've all been waiting for together for the last seven episodes. I'm back on the runway. Oh my god. Yeah, you look really great. Okay, first thing, the, um, we were not allowed to actually wear our finale outfits. We just had to bring like really fun outfits. Yeah. Because we were not allowed to overshadow the girls, which is understandable. Um, there were elements of my finale outfit, but it's not the full outfit. I'm not gonna show you the full outfit, of course, but like, yeah. maybe someday. Yeah, maybe someday. But what do you think about my outfit? I love it, okay? Thank you. I love it. Do you recognize the roses? <laughs> they, they've been <laughs> there for like eight episodes of the room view. People were like, oh, so sweet that you gave them to Envy. Girl, no, I got them back <laughs> home. Guess what? <laughs> you gave them to me. Yeah. A little, a, little, a little girl, I, I got on the train home and the little girl was like, are there flowers for your girlfriend? I was like, kinda. <laughs> It's Patty Pam Pam! Yes, hi Patty! Patty looks great, I love her hair, it's amazing. I love that ponytail, it's great. Love it. Love her earrings as well, matching yeah. her outfit, so... So cool. And the, the lips here, yeah. fin it's very Patty, it's very campy. Absolutely gorgeous, she looks stunning. Yeah. Great for this episode. <sighs> I've been waiting to say this. It's Megan Schumbrun! <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? I love this outfit. I would wear it as well. It's great. It's awesome. I really like it. Looks great yeah. on Megan as well. The hair, so cool, so yeah. fun. She looks happy as well. So. She was so happy. She was like, the judges were saying I wasn't sexy enough, bitch. I'm wearing <laughs> nothing. I'm bringing it now. Yeah, so cool. Yeah. Also, she had to have like a stylist and two other production crew <laughs> girls uh, tie her up in this corset thingy. She was like, oh, and, th and then another one was doing her nails. <laughs> she was like, oh, feeling her diva fantasy. I love her so much. Oh She's like, bitches, this is my last time yeah, here. Yeah, she was like, I'm gonna <laughs> enjoy it. <laughs> Madam Madness. She looks great. I love her makeup as always. Oh, I love the pointy yeah, the, just the about laser to say. and the makeup and the hair. Yes. And she was like, I wanted to do little pointy thing horns as well. And then she had like a little glasses suit yeah. of pointy things. This look is very madness. Yeah. The beard, I love it. The color is so cool. Yeah. So great to see everyone. Yeah. Seder Jean. Seder Jean in a Miss Piggy Redemption outfit. Yeah. <laughs> she told me that this dress was made in like three days. Yeah. She, she, she gave the designer three days to make this outfit. I think that girl is fierce. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Uh, and she knows how to turn it. She's like, I want this done, I want that done. But she's a businesswoman, she's a professional. And she shows it on this runway again. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. I was so happy to see Sajin again. Yeah. And um, we were sitting backstage next to each other. We really bonded that time. We were really, it was really fun. We were kicking everything. So great. Yeah. And Chelsea, bye! She was wearing a corona mask. <laughs> she was prepared. Oh, okay, was sorry. <laughs> Jesse Boy is in this, I don't know the reference, it's a reference yeah. to a video game character or a cartoon character, I don't know. Uh, very, very cool, the, yeah. this was lighting up. So cool. Yeah. Very Chelsea Boy. So great to see Chelsea Boy. Again. Yeah. Uh, one thing, 
while we had to wait four mm -hmm. hours for this, basically everyone's outfit broke. <laughs> my, my chin piece broke, Patty's heels broke. Oh, yeah, her <laughs> heel broke. She was like, she was like just walking there. Just <laughs> <laughs> and it had to be glued and then fine. And then I think her other heel broke as well. Uh, something fell out of Chelsea boys outfit, but we were like, we don't care at this point. We're just having fun. This is just like a yeah. family reunion to us. Like, we don't have to prove anything. No, you guys already did enough. One entire episode. It's enough. <laughs> <laughs> Fred gives us a great pep talk, read entirely from the outer queue. Thank you. Hmm. We're getting to the moment. Finale. First queen on the runway is Jane JK. She's flying on the yeah. runway. <laughs> With red wings. Yeah. I absolutely think that this is gorgeous. Yeah. Uh, if Janie had to do a finale outfit, it would be this. Yeah. The pattern, the fishnets, the glitter and the entire color all over. I think she could have done a little bit more of spectacular hair, but then again, yeah, this hair is very Janie. I would love another hair as well, but I love the wings, the wings are everything. Janie, you can give them to me, thank you very much. I love her high boots as well, with all the glitter on it. Looks beautiful, looks great on her. I want them. Look at you sitting there, babe. Oh yeah, it's me. Hey. <laughs> oh yeah, we totally forgot that we were also in the, in the shots. Like, you can see that when Envy comes, I'm like, uh. <laughs> so when we were back on the main stage with all the other eliminated girls, mm -hmm. we were so hungry. We were so hungry and we had a little break. We had to wait a little bit. And we saw Nikki tutorials. She had like a bag of chips, bag of chips. Crip. And Megan and me and Tedrashin were like, hey, psst, come here. <laughs> and her little assistant, he, he ran up to us and he gave us uh, some snacks. They were, she was like, here you go, here you go. We were like, oh, so... She was, she was so sweet. She's a queen. Yeah. And I was so excited to see her. I, I got... Uh, we had to walk on the runway. And the director, he was like, okay, you have to stand here and here. I'll show it to you. So I took a look around the corner and I saw her. And I was like... <laughs> and she was like... <laughs> so cute. So I stuff. hate this part of the show. I love this part. It's, it's the most beautiful part of the whole episode. Girl, this is so forced. We've seen this every finale. It's like... What do you want to say to little room? The thing is, you are so busy with doing stuff on this show. You don't even remember about that picture. So when you're standing yeah. there with like your picture, you're like, oh, that's me. But not if you've seen every finale of Drag Race because it gets brought back every episode. It's beautiful. It's I gorgeous. love it. Jenny looks kind of cute though. Fred is showing a baby picture of the girls and I love this moment. It's beautiful. It's talking about a lot of things. <laughs> you already watched it, so yeah. Well, what would you say though? To myself? Yeah. Uh, you're gay. <laughs> oh god. There we go. Okay. Uh, yeah. You're. Let me take a seat for this. Beautiful, perfect. You look like a model. You look like Lind Evangelista. You could walk in a diaper if you want to. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Jane. Your story is beautiful. You said everything, baby. I don't know. I would tell myself that uh, I should stay in my own little fantasy bubble because that's going to bring me wherever I want to. Yeah. And Look at uh, you now, still in your bubble. And I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so right there in the bubble, so it's okay. As, as long as I'm there. <laughs> what would you say? Girl, I can write a whole book. <laughs> Cancel. <laughs> In the beginning, <laughs> no joke. <laughs> God created Adam Eve and Drag Queen Fate Intervention. <laughs> yeah. Well, you guys will see next year what I have to say, so. If she gets that far. Next queen is Miss Abby Oh My Gothic. <laughs> and she is serving something very different yeah. than we've seen from her. Yeah. You can see it on my face. It was like, <laughs> She's like full coverage. This is something really new. I didn't I didn't expect this from, from Abby. So I'm gagged. I love like the cape that she's wearing. I agree, it's very beautiful. Um, I think the headpiece is very fun. Yeah. This is also a reference to something I don't know, but I don't really care. This is her ultimate best drag. I don't think it's her ultimate best drag. No. 
But it's a very gorgeous outfit. And yeah. I'm not the one to judge that. It's like, if you want to do that, fine. Yeah, we ain't judging today. No, no we're judging. We, we did. <laughs> We've done judging for five years. We don't need to be. Yeah, you were so critical. mean. Girl, I can't. I was so sweet. <sighs> Everyone looks so great. People in the comments, you know exactly how I feel. I'm a block you. Sit, see that block. <laughs> Fred is showing Abby's picture as well, and she looks so cute! She looks exactly the same. Yeah. <laughs> Abby's telling her story, and I think she has a beautiful story. She's telling that sometimes you can't uh, find support by your own family, so... Yeah, I, I was really I was really tearing up yeah. in, the, in the back. I was like, I feel you. Ooh. Oh! Hello, it's Envy Peru! <laughs> what would Envy do? What would Envy do? <laughs> Block you. <laughs> Envy Peru walks in the runway in this Dida Von Tees. Yeah. I wouldn't say inspired, it's a copy. Uh, <laughs> outfit, which is absolutely gorgeous with this huge coat. Um, also, this giant piece of hair, I don't know. It's feather though. It's a feather thingy. You could see my face next to her. <laughs> she entered and I was like... <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, Envy up close looks even prettier. Like, you don't see it, but like the shine on her legging and the way her corset is sparkling and the way she moves. And I was, I, I, I was just forgetting that the cameras were on me as well. <laughs> like, <laughs> and Peter's sitting there like... Hmm, interesting. Yeah. I could have made that for five bucks. <laughs> Yeah. No, I really love this outfit. It's great. It's awesome. It's fantastic. I would wear it definitely as well. Mm -hmm. So, Abby, you can... Uh, Abby... <coughs> Cancel. Envy! <laughs> you can send it to me as well. <laughs> I love her hair as well. Yeah. Of course, she's wearing her expensive suit again. So, Nikki Pest is all happy. Fashion. Exact beauty. Exact fashion. Envy is basically telling, follow your heart. Do your thing. You're gonna be fine. Don't listen to anyone. Yeah. And last but not least, it's Mama Queen. Yeah. Mama Queen is wearing this feather wings something thing. Yeah, it's really Mama Queen. We have no clue what it is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly what it is. But she has a concept and... She's going for it. Yeah, uh, she would, did it. <laughs> I wouldn't say that it's my favorite look. No. But if she's feeling it, if yeah. that's her best yeah. drag, and I'm not saying it's ugly. No, 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 I'm not saying that, no. But, girl, you live your fantasy. Yeah. I love it. Uh, and I also told her behind the scenes that I want those horns yeah. that she's wearing. I was like, she's yeah. like, I can make them for you. And I'm like, I'll hold yeah, girl. that. The picture of Mama Queen. I was just expecting this picture. That was really nothing else I was expecting though. She looks like a queen. Yeah. I love it. She's like Maxima the Queen. She was like Mama Queen from the beginning. Mama Queen prepared this like five years before the show. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> she, has, she has a whole story to tell. This is uh, chapter one from Autobiography. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a very beautiful story. It's very beautiful. Yeah. So we've watched this season and we came to the conclusion that we missed some drag knowledge. But I feel like this episode, they're not saying things that I don't agree with. It's like, there isn't like anything that yeah. I like, that I find a weird comment or mm -hmm, anything. Mm -hmm. So uh, I see progress and I yeah. see opportunity for a next season. Yes, proud of you guys. After the judges are done with their judgy judgments. Yes. <laughs> Uh, they have to pick two girls who are not going to be in the top two. And one of them is, unfortunately, yeah. Abby OMG. Uh, she doesn't make the top two, but we kind of saw that coming, though. So it's yeah. not a big surprise. But the judges tell her that she was a great addition to the show. She was great with lip syncing. She yeah. brought the television. She brought the drama. She the brought drama, entertainment. <laughs> so, uh, and the judges also say that Maybe she wasn't fully ready for this season yeah. yet. The other queen who also doesn't make the top two is Mama Queen. 
Yes. Oh. Yeah. Mama Queen did really good this season. Um, I'm really proud of her. Yeah. She really made her statement though. She, she really gave us kind of education lessons about uh, about being yourself, accepting yourself, um, being a non-binary person. So I am really proud of her. I'm so happy that she did. And she's also a very special queen with a lot of a lot of ide ideas and concepts and stuff like that. I have to say, when she entered the workroom, uh, I w underestimated her. I thought she goes home third, maybe four. But seeing her do so well in this season, I'm like, you yeah. deserve that spot. It's all yours. Yeah. And I have to take all my words back and I fully agree with what you just said. Uh, Mama Queen is such a special queen and uh, there is no one else who should be in that top three. So if you're watching Mama Queen, thank you, sweetheart. Thank you so much. And now it's the top two. Yeah. Between... Envy Peru. And Jay Nijakui. Yes. I was so excited for this. Yeah. Just look at my face this entire episode. <laughs> just, look at, just look at my face this entire lip sync. Yeah. I was like... And I was lip syncing, dancing in the back. <laughs> This <laughs> Fred. Like, Fred. <laughs> Jean is so fun to watch, though. Yeah, Envy as well. Though. Yeah, she is bringing it. Everyone in the back is just like, yeah. Yeah. Oh, this moment with Envy. Yeah. How? Girl, I was shocked. Okay. Me too. <laughs> oh, you look so cute. I can't. Well, finally a great lip sync this season. Yeah, this is the moment, honey. Oh, I, I was just in shock. Not that I didn't expect it. I was there. Oh, she deserves it. Yeah, Envy totally deserves it. Not gonna talk about the crown that fell over her head, but mm -mm. <laughs> Envy was so shocked that RuPaul yeah. was calling her name. RuPaul was probably in some kind of basement, <laughs> like. Dear Room, Dear Patty Pam Pam, <laughs> Dear Madam Madness, Dear Megan Shu and Brew. The roses for yeah! Envy! I, I stole them again. <laughs> oh my god, this was a whole roller coaster, honey! My god, yeah. Envy Peru is the winner of the first season of Drag Race. Well, I was, but <laughs> she is not only the most deserving winner in my opinion, but also literally the sweetest soul. I'm so happy that Drag Race is finally here in Netherlands. Yeah in Holland uh, so that the world can see our form of track and who knows maybe next season we're, we sit, we're here again next year but the roles are reversed and we're, <laughs> we're here to discuss your uh, elimination the first episode girl <laughs> I'm not leave I'm telling you guys I'm not leaving that soon okay when we Mark my words when we remove you next year I'll cut to this moment <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a great season, great yeah, talent, uh, amazing first cast. Don't know who Definitely. they're gonna cast for next season, but there is so much talent, and I hope there's a next season. Fingers crossed, yes. at least a season two. There needs a little bit of improvement to be done. Yeah, but it's a first season, so. Your favorite part was? I think me. No, uh, my favorite part was definitely. Uh, get for myself getting to know the other queens because I'm not really I wasn't really involved yeah. in the drag scene and now I feel like I am and it, it feels really good. Uh, I don't want to go Well, but we have to go <laughs> So if you like this video <laughs> uh, Go ahead and share this with all your drag friends family all the people we're Gonna uh, miss you guys. Yeah, we're gonna miss yeah. you so much. This was so much fun to do. We hope you'll be there in the future with our next projects and whatever we're gonna do if it's together if it's alone whatever we hope you'll be there supporting us uh, because we can't wait for you to join us on our adventure to yeah. conquer in the world if you like this video go ahead and subscribe to my channel because i'm gonna upload every week and sharing great content i know, I know fate will too so go ahead and subscribe to her channel as well all the links are in the description <laughs> we really appreciate you and we can't wait to see you again yeah. Go ahead and follow us on social media to stay up to date on what's coming and what's yeah. going on. And, but for now, we have to go. Yeah.
And uh, congratulations to Envy Peru. Yes, girl. She deserves it. Viva Peru. Viva Peru. I deserve it more. No, just kidding. Go. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. 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 See you. I don't want to go. I can't leave them behind. No. I'm looking way too good to get his makeup off right now. <laughs> well, before we go, something really important. The last Dutch education lesson. We can't forget that. The last yeah. thing we want to teach you is tot ziens. Tot ziens. And that means goodbye. See you later. See you later. And we hope to see you later. Yes. So, tot ziens. Tot ziens. Tot ziens. Bye bye. Tot bye. Ziens. Bye. Doei. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Stop it. Hand shoe. <laughs> Hans Frikandellen. Frikandellen. <laughs> I'm ready to leave this. Girl, they'll, they'll see you next season. As I told at the beginning, this is the only gig. <laughs> yeah, let me take this baby off because... Oh my god, I look... Mm. It's Chelsea boy! <laughs> Do you want to buy this wig? I'm selling it now. I need money to buy my dresses for Drag Race Holland season 2. <laughs> Later from the stars of here. <laughs> now my dad. You know, you know what? You know what's the greatest moment on what? Drag Race? Is that Sadejean kept calling Sanavala Sabris Saskia. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I killed her. <laughs>